What's going on, everybody? Hope everybody's doing fine. Kalisos Reef here, bringing you this quick update on my bonsai reef. It's a three month mark on the tank. And, you know, decided to do a quick update so you guys know what's going on. Um, first thing, anything, Merry Christmas to everybody. Hope everybody's enjoying these holidays and having fun and hope everybody got what they wanted for christmas i know i did i'm gonna do a video later of the stuff that i got for christmas um mostly i bought it myself but hey it's still christmas for me so um as you guys know this is a cube um it's an you know a nano reef um everything's an experiment for me you know keeping a small <clears throat> salt water tank and see how it works everything how everything coexists with each other but everything's doing fine filter is working amazing can't complain about this filter it's rated for 40 gallons so hey that's a seven and a half gallon and i got a um filter rated for 40 gallons so that's more than enough filtration for this little tank i also got a protein skimmer it's an iq skimmer for those that don't know if you want to see my unboxing check my videos i got an unboxing video in there it's a nice skimmer it's working amazing amazing i'm really surprised with the way that thing performed I'm gonna show you guys, look all the nasty stuff collected in the back. I added that extra container in the back so my collection could be clear. I don't, you know, so I could get rid of more stuff and I don't have to be cleaning that often. Make it more easy for me. But everything in the tank is doing good. Can't complain. Um, I know a lot of people that see this video say I, I got a lot of livestock in a small tank. It's true. But like I say, I got a nice filtration. I do my regular maintenance on the tank. Test the um, for nitrates, ammonia, all the stuff. Everything always, you know, so far so good. Knock on wood. And, hey, you know, like, if you want to keep something, you want to house a lot of livestock in it, you got to do your maintenance on the tank. So... But nothing, you know, as you guys can see, you know, things are doing good. Look at my Gorgonian. Beautiful, beautiful color. It got its color back. It was dying. So now it's got its color back. Uh, my Palito Garden is doing great. Look at how open they are. I got... I'm, do, I'm, I'm running a, an experiment in this tank and... And once I show you guys what the experiment is, you guys gonna see. Yeah, like if you guys look at my past video and look at the corals before, they wasn't open like this. And whatever I'm doing now is working. Look how big um the Pulsen Senior guy and the cold tree. Look at the extension and those Monty, it's an encrusted Monty. Look all the polyps out. Let me let me zoom in so you guys can see. Look at all those polyps. They're all out. In a small in such a small little piece of Monty. But yeah. Like whatever I'm doing is working. So, you know, like I don't know if I did a video um about new stuff I added to the tank, basically. The only thing I added so far was this three feather dusters. And this coral I had in my main display upstairs wasn't doing that good. I brought it down here. The bowls came back out. So hopefully it's going to get better in time. That's my, I'm crossing my fingers on that. Um, My mushroom garden is, look at how open those mushrooms are. It's beautiful, man. My seahorse is doing good. That's my black stallion. Sorry for the shakiness. He's a character. Let me see if I can zoom in. Come on. 
Look at how beautiful that guy is. <laughs> A ton of personality. Um, my clownfish are doing good too. This one, like I did the other video, like to get high. Always hanging in the bag. Look at my mandarin. Rarely see in the videos. Always hiding in the back. But it's time for some feeding, so let me do some feeding while I talk to you guys. So what I do, I shut off the filter. They already know it's time to eat. I feed them um, micey shrimps. That's why I do a lot of maintenance on the tank because it's a lot of nutrients going in the water. But... I always throw some food for the clowns. And then I feed the seahorse, but the seahorse will always go and find his own food. As you guys can see, he don't hesitate. He's a go-getter. And then I throw some food on the back for the mandarin. He will... Enjoying his own meal in the back. The firefish is hiding right now. But he will eventually come out in a minute. While he see or smell the food in the water. But yeah, the tank is doing great. <clears throat> oh, I gotta do this before she kills me. But... I want to send a shout out to my little baby, my daughter. There we go, the firefish. Sorry, baby. <laughs> but this is my daughter, Nayali. And she said, Papi, you haven't mentioned me in the video. So there she is. Love you, baby, if you watch this video. Hope you have a Merry Christmas. <laughs> I love that little girl. So, yeah. So everything is doing great in the tank. Um, the corals showing a lot, a lot of growth, a lot of polyp and tension. Everybody's doing good. Everybody's healthy. And that's how we're going to keep it. Keep my regular maintenance on the tank. Make sure everything is running the way it's supposed to. And that's how it got to be. So, quick update on the tank. You know, this is a three-month mark. Everything's working fine. Like I say, the protein skimmer is doing this job. It's skimming the water good. The look me like I'm surprised. The coral growth I'm getting with it. Not as fast as I want it, but hey. Um, nobody understands the corals. The, you know, the grow rates they got with, with lights and supplements and stuff we have in the water. So some corals do better in other tanks. than You know, nobody knows. So, but everything's doing great in this tank. Everything's showing growth. That's that's the main goal, making sure everything just get nice and, you know, the whole rock get full. I'm adding all the corals in this tank in the future, so stay tuned for that. The filter is working fine. Haven't complained. No hiccups with it. And let's knock on wood for that. Pretty soon I'm going to remove that algae. That, um, it's a Calarpa polyphora. I'm gonna remove it out of there. I'm adding all this stuff to the tank, so. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this little nano reef. Like I say, it's a bonsai reef. That's the theme I'm going with it. Make it look like a little bonsai. Um, Nothing, let me know what you guys think. I hope you guys enjoying this day today. Merry Christmas to everybody. And please, if you drink, pass the key. Enjoy this day with the family and friends. And I see you guys in the next one. All right. Thank you for watching. Kalisos Reef out.